Happening now, Folly Beach residents are voting to decide whether the city should regulate short-term rentals. News 2's Kevon Dupree joins us live from the polling place on Folly and Kevon. Polls have been open since 7 o'clock this morning. What's the turnout been like so far? Carolyn and the polls will stay open until 7 o'clock tonight, and tonight's vote is to determine whether a cap should be placed on the number of short-term rentals here on Folly Beach. Now, this special election is to determine if the city will adopt or reject an ordinance which limits the number of short-term rental licenses in the city to 800. There are currently more than 1,100 active short-term rental licenses within the city limits. This proposal was first introduced by a group of Folly residents who go by Save Folly's Future. Some residents see short-term rentals as a threat to the community that has been established on the island by longtime residents. Now the vote on whether to cap the short-term rentals at 800 or not will be decided by Folly Beach's nearly 2,000 registered voters. And once again, the polls close at 7 o'clock tonight, and I'm told by election officials that they should have results in by 9 p.m. tonight. Reporting live from Folly Beach, I'm Kevon Dupree. Count on two.